children go to heaven without queuing. Author Ojena Helena Mazur Nowak. Mommy, mommy, a child is crying. Where are you? I'm afraid. Baby sobs. I'm sitting on a swing. Can you see me, mom? I don't recognize our house. Just the same swing in the backyard and dumpster, the same carpet beater we used to play on. And a little boy cries behind the garbage bin. He says everyone around is dead. Mommy! Mommy, I remember us sitting at the kitchen table while you were preparing breakfast for us. Dad rang us and said he loves us and he was safe. Grandma made brides for me and grandfather was looking around for his dentures, as usual before a meal. The milk has boiled at the stove. I like the smell of milk when it pours from the pot. Then I remember such a terrible noise and a whistle and a huge bang. After that, I don't remember anything anymore. And it got very dark, cold and quiet. Why are you crying, child? The voice from above asked. I'm looking for my mom. The baby sobs again. Your family is safe now. The calm voice answered. But where? The child asked through tears. They are standing in a line to heaven. To heaven? And what about me? Children go to heaven without a cue because they are innocent. You have cried a lot and God let you go back to collect your favorite teddy bear. Have you found it? No. The house is burned down, everything burned down and the baby cries again. Don't cry, please. Come with me. I will take you to your mom now. The child confidently holds angel hand, the one who couldn't protect her from death. This time it was an angel who cried looking at the enormity of the solution. And the whole world looks at these nasty crimes of genocide, shows them in the media, shows how those innocent children's motionless bodies go to heaven instead of going to school. Another page in history is written in front of our eyes. But if someone will remember it when a mad idiot presses the red button,